And now Elaine and Amy from All About Pies are here in the kitchen to bake a pie with me. What kind of pie are we going to bake? We're going to do a cranberry raspberry pie for the holidays. Oh, wonderful. Is this a new one for you? Yes, it is. We haven't made this before, but we thought this would be a good accent to a dessert for, for turkey and ham. Yeah. Wonderful. And during the holiday season, you make hundreds of pies, right? Yes, we do. And you have a system, I understand. Mm -hmm. So, Amy, I know that you are in charge mm -hmm. of dough, so why don't you get I us am. started? I am. Right. And what kind of and fat do you use in the dough? We use vegetable shortening. Okay. Mm -hmm. And usually what I do is I try to start out with a circle, because hopefully then you'll get a circle for the pie tin. Right. <laughs> and, and you like your dough to be cold when you I start? I like it chilled. Yes, definitely. And if it's, I add more flour if I need to, as needed. And I turn it several times, trying to get that circle. All right. So. And what's the secret to good pie crust? Uh, not to overwork it. And. Do you want those, the shortening to, mm -hmm. to stay mm -hmm. in pockets so it's nice and flaky? Exactly. All right. And now I have my pie this. tin, yes. Great. I fold it in half. Center it in the pie tin, unfold it. Perfect. And then Elaine will take it from All there. All right, Elaine, you are in charge of filling, so show us what you're going to do. I'm going to use three cups of raspberries. And there's a cup and a half of cranberries. We use about a cup and a fourth of sugar, so I need to leave a little bit in here. A quarter cup of flour and about a half teaspoon of almond. Oh, nice flavoring. Just mix that up. Now, I know your mom kind of got this started with uh, making a few pies to sell, and yes, then it took did. off from there, but it really took off because your kids prefer pie to cake. Yes. But. Yes, they wanted that for the graduation. My two, my two boys did. All right, mm -hmm. and then, and then, as a sister, you got pulled into this I endeavor did. as well. I did. Wonderful. <laughs> All right, and so now we're back to the top crust. Yes, we are. So now, yes, I'm going to make the top crust, and we're going to, for the holiday, we're going to add some little uh, star shapes and cut out some of the pie dough. Add a little different look to it. Wonderful. And. Again, your mom sort of started this whole thing, but she taught you how to work the dough and how mm -hmm. to flute the pie, but mm -hmm. she says you do this wrong? She so. said I do, <laughs> only because she was standing across the table from me when I was doing this. So when it came to time for fluting and turning the tin to flute, mm -hmm. I was doing what she was doing mirror image, though. So, <laughs> so you do it backwards. So I do. Her. I do. And we're going to cut pretty little stars in here. Nice. Kind of adds a little bit to the pie. And I'm going to just take that out. And we're going to take those out without tearing the rest of the crust apart. <laughs> and I actually did that. Hooray! <laughs> right. well, Lay it on top nicely. Right. A lot of people want to uh, cut off the edges, but you mm -hmm. want it folded under. I, as long as there is not too much, which mm -hmm. this really is pretty, pretty good uh, amount. So I'm just gonna roll that under. Wonderful. And this is where I did the mirror image of what my mother did. And so <laughs> we turn the pan differently and I flute differently. But I kind of have this little <laughs> style of doing this. And if after I works, get it all it rolled works. under, I'm going to press that down. OK. Make sure it's all sealed nice and tight so none of the fruit seeps out. And then I start crimping. Let's put that. I need to put a little, little bit of sugar, sugar on it and put it in the oven. Mm -hmm. This just adds a little bit of a sparkle to it. And you bake that for an hour? Yes, so. an hour at 350. Right. And fortunately, we have one that is made. 
And All we'll, ready to we'll go. Pull that out. It looks like it's browned nicely. Oh, that is beautiful. But not over brown. Lovely. I'll get the going for you. All right. Thank you. And of course, that is rocket hot. So we have to let yes. that sit for a while. But there it is go. so beautiful. Elaine and Amy, thank you so thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you for having us.